Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. It is me, Marsha, and I am back with another video. Today I'm going to be doing something a little different, but I was bored and I have to go somewhere today and I wanted to do like a little thing. So I decided I'm gonna go on Pinterest and I'm gonna let Pinterest decide my hair and my makeup for today. So the first thing I'm going to do is my hair. Um, so I, I will put the picture up right here so you guys can see how I'm going to try to do it. So I just punched in hairstyles for short hair and then I pick the first picture that comes up and that's what I have to try to look like. So in the picture, it looks like she just straightens her hair. So I'm gonna go ahead and straighten my hair. Okay, now I did that, straightened my hair, now I'm just going to spray some dry shampoo in it just to give it a little texture. Now, for her hair, she took like this top section. She had those little hairs. And then she took this section. I'm looking at the mirror behind me, y'all, just so you know. And hers was kind of like messy. So let's make it a little messy. And then I'm just taking my little uh, rubber band or elastic, whatever you want to say. And then she just had this. This is a very easy hairstyle, so I was glad this came up and not some braid. And then it was just like, does that look good? Um, um, yeah. So like this. Okay, I think that's how she had hers. This side isn't cooperating with me. That's the problem with short hair. Every time I straighten it and then it lays on my neck and then it makes a little curve. So yeah, okay. So here is the hairstyle. I think I'm close enough to her. Maybe she didn't have this much. Did she like that? I like that. Anyways, so here is the hairstyle that she did or that I tried to copy. Let me know if you guys think I did like a good copy of hers or what you guys think down in the comments right down there. The comment section is new, you guys. I don't know if it changed on your YouTube, but it did on mine. And it's on the top now instead of the bottom. So you don't have to scroll as far down to comment. So go ahead and comment and let me know yes or no. Did I do it or did I not do it? So let me know right now in the comments down below. And let's get into the makeup look that Pinterest had for me. But before I do that, guys, please, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button right down there for me. I would appreciate it so, so much. And yeah, just do that. And then also, if you do that, let me know in the comments and I will thank you. So 
let's get right into this. So guys, now it is time for the makeup look. And I will also put the makeup look up for you guys, but. I'm just gonna get right into it. I'm gonna try to copy it as close as possible, but I'm not sure if I can do it like she did it because I mean, her makeup looks amazing. And you know, I don't know if I have those colors either. So I'm just gonna try and copy it. Right now I'm just priming my face. So next I am going to go in and do my eyebrows and her eyebrows are kind of dark and they look perfect. So I'm going to try to do mine like hers. I don't know if I can, but I'm going to try. So. Okay, I think that brow looks good. Now let's move on to the next one. I do think this brow over here looks better. I mean, this one just looks like, I don't know what, but I am going to clean it up with some concealer. Okay, this concealer is a little dark, but that's okay with me. So now next I am going to apply my foundation and I'm just going to use the Fit Me Matte Foundation. I'm gonna actually put it on my brush first. I'm gonna get my hair out of my face. There is that. Now let me go in with my concealer. And just blend this out. And next, I am just going to go in with my bronzer. I use the Gigi Gorgeous Bronzer. Absolutely love this bronzer. Next, I am just going to put my highlighter on. Here we go. It already looks like I have some on, but I don't. And she has a bunch like 
Let me get another little brush here. I'll probably have to fix this up anyway after I'm done, but she has a bunch right here, like just shining. The next thing I'm going to do is probably dive into this eye look. Oh my gosh, I'm kind of nervous for the eye look because it is so hardcore. And I don't know if I have all these shades because it's kind of red. I don't know if I have all these shades, but I'm going to get all my makeup palettes and see what I have. Anyway, first, I am going to go in and put some concealer or prime the lids. I just put a little bit on, prime it with my finger. Oops. Well, maybe not. I didn't know this was so rough. Okay, guys, so there we go. There is that. Now, it looks like she has kind of, let me get my fluffy brush. It looks like she kind of has a lighter red. Let me see, I have to look in all my, okay, it looks kind of like she has this shade on the whole eyelid. So I'm gonna go in with this shade and just apply it all over. Okay, so she did that color. Oh my gosh, I'm not used to this. I haven't put eyeshadow on myself in like the longest time. So this is kind of looking different. Anyways, so then she has like a darker, like a brown color. I'm going to think go with this color here. And I'm just going to put it like in my crease. And especially focusing it on the outer crease here, like so. And I'm just going to be tapping it in. Okay, this eye over here just looks like crazy. I'm going to go in with a more defined brush. Let me clean it off first, like not as fluffy. And I'm going to take that dark shade. Actually, I'm going to take a little darker shade. Let me see if I can find one. Here. I'm going to take like this shade here and just focus it a little more out here. And in the inner corner, like she did, I think I just look like somebody punched me. I never go this hardcore. But that's okay. Today is about trying new things, y'all. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, and then she kind of has, let me take this fluffy brush and take this shade again. She kind of has that on the lower lash. And on top of that, she took like that dark red shade, which I'm gonna use this and go down here. I'm like using every makeup palette that I have to create this and yeah she goes all the way in I'm gonna flare this out a little more and it looks like she I have like very hooded eyes and she doesn't so that is the problem here so let me take like my big fluffy brush again and kind of just blend these edges because honey 
they look scary. Okay, and then blend this side. Okay, so I'm going to leave that like it is. I'm not going to mess with it anymore because the more I keep messing with it, the more I'm going to ruin it, and I don't want to ruin it. And next, she has like this very, very shimmery shade on like the inner like the center so i'm gonna try to do that i mean i don't know if i can do it because i don't even know if i have a shimmer that shines that much but right now i'm just gonna put some concealer in the middle here And then I am just going to go in. I'm going to first, I'm going to have use to use a couple. I know that already because I don't have as shiny of a shade as she does. So I'm just going to spray my brush. And then I'm going to go in with this shade right here. Just apply it all over my brush. And then I'm just going to like brush it on there. I'm going to try to use my finger because my finger always works so much better. There we go. Ooh. That actually looks so much like hers. Now I am just going to take another brush and take that shade and put it right in here. Actually, I'm just going to use my finger again. That's how hers looks. Like shining honey. There we go. And the next thing, I'm just gonna take this brush again. Actually, let me get my fluffier brush. Where did I put you? Hmm. This brush, and I'm gonna take the dark shade that I was using, and I'm just gonna blend in the corners. like that blend them in like that does that look good oh, let me clean this area up and get a little more in there i'm gonna take my smaller brush I'm just trying to fix it, girls. There. Ooh. Okay, so that's how that looks. That's the eyeshadow look. That's the best I can do. I'm not going to keep fiddling with it because I feel like the more I like fiddle with it, the more it's going to look you know, ugly. So I think this looks pretty close to hers. Next, I am just going to go in and do my lashes. I'm going to put some false lashes on just because hers look like so big and mine are just, you know, nothings. Okay, now I'm just going to apply some false lashes. And I hope this doesn't mess up the look because literally I never wear false lashes. And this is probably the time, you know, that I will wear them and it'll just like mess everything up. But please no. Oops. I got some glue on me. So let us. It looks like it got a little tacky. So let's apply them. Ha. <laughs> Okay, y'all. Lashes are on. Oh my gosh, that took so long to do those lashes and I got glue everywhere. This is the reason I don't normally wear lashes because, you know, it just takes me so much longer to do it. So yeah, but I did it for you guys today. 
and I will put the picture up right now so you guys can see it again and see how close do you think I I did to her. Just Anyways, this is the finished look. Oh, I didn't put anything on my lips. Let me just put a little gloss. I want some lip gloss. There we go. So I just put a little lip gloss on my lips for the lip area because the eyes are so, so much and I did not want to add on to it. So this is it. This is the final look. Let me go. Not let me know in the comments what you think uh, of this look and how you think I did. Like from a scale of one to ten, how close do you think I got to her look? So please let me know. And this is it. Um, Pinterest picked my hair and my makeup so that is how i'm gonna be walking around today like this i'm gonna be looking like you know i got places to go and people to see but in reality i ain't seeing nobody and you know this look is just going to be my daughter's gonna see my look and that's it so i did all this for my daughter so hopefully she feels special anyways guys this is it for today please let me know in the comments if you like it and if you haven't already please go ahead and hit that subscribe button right down there for me i would appreciate it so so much and i will be back with another video in about a couple days so if you guys want me to do something please let me know if what kinds of videos you guys want to see and I will do them for you. So that is it for today. I will stop talking. I know I'm so hyper because I have coffee and you know, coffee makes me want to, mm, 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 mm. I don't know. What am I doing? Literally. I don't know. Anyways, that is it. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.